Let's check out the teams. Gerald Clancy returns for Liverpool, having missed the game versus Ajax on match day two. The centre half, who was part of England's under 19 European Championship winning squad in the summer, is recalled, along with James McConnell in two changes to the side that defeated the Amsterdam club. Well, not surprisingly, Rangers are unchanged from the team that defeated Napoli at home in their last game in the competition. Robbie Yeur made his first team debut in the League Cup this season and netted in a 3-1 success over Queen of the South. The 18-year-old can boast three goals in the Lowland League also this term and will be the visitors' main attacking threat through the centre. Liverpool versus Rangers then at under-19 level. The UEFA Youth League always a competition. Again, good looking first time ball in. Massive opportunity for you, but he can only put it wide. Kick duty here. It's the top of the wall. Ricochets through and corner whipped in here. And as Quanza wins the first ball, it's Cannoneer. Who else from close range to not home? Us. Oh my word! How unlucky. Well, you switch off with this young man, and anything can happen. All in one movement, so unlucky not to curl in. Thought he got away from Liverpool's number nine, that's never the case. Liverpool coming forward here, oh, off the post, and the follow-up from Goat goes in. Liverpool have a second. Well, terrific running once again, really good interchange of play between Frauendorf and Chambers and then Clark's effort here off the post, he's onside though. He reacted quicker than Robbie Fraser. Be some great performances, it's in towards Canoneer again, it's Doug to turn and McConnell's effort over. Now some very clever football from Liverpool. Canoneer, Doak and McConnell all involved here. Clark likewise. Canoneer left it, Doak turned, then hesitated. Looking just to get it here by Cornes, who lets fly! And straight pretty much at the keeper either side, that would have... See, oh, just a little slow. Doak. And it comes. Pushed up into the air by Pazikas and nodded away by Nsio. This is Cornes under pressure, deals with that brilliantly. Chambers to come forward, good effort. Kalanir tries to get something on it, it's cleared only to the edge of the area. Now it's with Clark, thought about the curler on his left and then the effort with the right. Towards Kalanir, he'll turn. At the break, it is Liverpool 2, Rangers 0. Throughout, the goal came a few minutes into the second half. Kwanzaa from Cornes's corner. I think Cornes had a really good game. And Kwanzaa had the assist for the first goal, helped himself to the third of the outside. Goes for glory. Well, every right, I think. And when he received the ball back, I think on his favoured foot, to the D's, got every right to have a crack at goal. Plenty of options, of course, but three to the good. In a situation like that, lifted inside the area, taken down by Clark first time, looking to make just half a yard. Pazikas gets down through. This is Cannonier, and now it's with Doak. Good save from Pazikas. Cannonier teed it up perfectly. Doak ran onto this one. Pazikas got his footwork spot on. Stays with the legs. Let's go with the hits. Sat up nicely for him. Comfortable though. Called in by McCausland. Big chance here for Lovelace. Terrific save from Davis. Well, now we have seen him in action. Good connection. Terrific stop. Punted long here, trying to get Frauendorf in round the back. Pazikas outside of his area, presumably right on the edge of the area here. Mm, no VAR in uh, UEFA Youth League, that might be a good thing for uh, Pazikas. Clark. 
Oh, a wonderful touch from Fraundorfer. Must score here. He's been denied by Pazikas. That should have been a fourth. A lot of space between uh, Rangers defenders. First couple of touches were excellent. Pazikas got down well. For power rather than placement. And the Cochrane Miles covers. Touch from Lindsay. Good effort. Credit Fraser for keeping it in play. Made space well here. And Lindsay's effort wasn't far away. This will be a better angle for us. As they were against Dykes in the 4-0 win. Well, there could be a fourth here. This is Chambers. There is. But he's got forward to good effect throughout this game. He's gone close on a couple of occasions. Thoroughly deserved. Definitely on. Nil feels about right. I don't think Rangers fans can complain about that. One last chance for Rangers to get a consolation, perhaps. Not the worst ball in, you know. Doesn't fall to a blue shirt. Might do now. It does. Thumped home by the substitute, Connor Young. Persistent play down the left hand side. And as Liverpool looked to clear, it fell kindly for Connor Young to thump home. Still had to find its way through, but good composure here from the Rangers substitute. Maybe it's got something on it, but not enough. Doesn't affect the result, of course. Liverpool with goals from Cannonier, Doak, Quanta and Chambers. With that young consolation, far too good to pick up a comfortable 4-1 win.